Good evening. Well, um, thank you for joining me. Uh, tonight I'm going to show you how to do um, this paper bag tutorial. Um, this isn't decorated, well it's decorated but it's not glued down yet. Just to show you what the cover is going to be like. But we'll be leaving the cover to last. So let's start. Take everything off for now. So we're starting with just paper, paper brown bags. I've done a few, I've glued them together, I'll show you how to do that. Um, so let's get started. So each time you're going to glue the back. And then you're going to add. So you always keep the back side and the bottom of the paper bag facing towards you. These can become um, compact, so if you're going to do one, don't do it too large, too big, um, because they, you will struggle to open it. So we'll start with that for now, but that's how you, you join your paper bags together. And each one should open. And this is what I mean about um, they get get too compact. So I think that's a good enough size to start with. And you always get this bend on the front. So we'll start with the inside covers first. I'm just checking to see if it yeah, fits in fit right. Um, so for these sides, I've done bigger ones, and then for these sides, I've done smaller ones, and then the strip in the middle, cover like that, and then what we're going to be doing is, I've got some pockets so let's glue these down a minute I really struggle to um, speak or make a conversation when I'm doing this. Um, as you know, I'm quite new to doing tutorials. So, I've kind of tried to just to get on with it. I'm 
as I say, um, I do make mistakes, and I apologise for that. I know a lot of people like to see perfection in the tutorials, but I'm not that kind of person, so if I make mistakes, I do go over them afterwards. I'm not too fussy about doing a perfect tutorial, but I just try to show you the basis of how things are done. Sometimes I don't even complete a tutorial, but everyone should know by what I've shown them how to do things and carry on from there. You can add um, all your decorations as you want, um, I'm just showing you the basics, I will be decorating this further when I'm finished. I'll do a few pages so you know kind of which way to go and how I'm doing them and then I'll do the cover and I'll leave the rest up to you um, guys to do. Um, if I do something that you dislike, um, I did notice um, a thumbs down. We all get them. I know I will get many more. But if you are going to give a thumbs down to any channel, not just mine, um, I think it's personally, you don't have to be nasty about it, but please do explain in the comments 
what it is that you found that you didn't like so we can improve on things um, you know I'm clueless why I've got a thumbs down maybe it's because I dribble on and I talk a load of rubbish or because I don't finish projects the glue I'm using the way my method is and doing things um, you know I, I prefer if you left a comment just to say you know um, I didn't find this helpful because such can you improve on such and such we um we all learn and we can't learn unless we haven't been told um, as you probably know by um, my tutorials and videos by now I use a lot of uh, simply shabbalicious stuff um, and I've been using quite a lot of the December kit, which is um, called Year of Hope. There's lots to it. Um, as you can see, there's a calendar, mini calendar. I've done quite a lot with this, some shaker cards. Um, so this kit will be available uh, until the 15th of December. No, yeah, 15th of January, sorry. Um, and each each month on the 15th she will bring out um, a new kit and these kits are then not available for I say six months she she does offer every I think six months and um, the next one will be February um, so if you signed up um, for her for her kits um, on a subscription you'll get a offer email to go and purchase past kits that you might have missed out on um, maybe you couldn't have purchased them at the time uh, maybe you're new um, so every six months you'll be able to go back and purchase one of her kits that you actually like or want and the next one's in February so mark it on your calendar I don't care if it's glue it will dry I can always wipe off and redo so I say I'm not being fussy with my tutorials
go around, I, will, I actually will, but I'll do that later on, um, go around and add lace to different parts of it, decorate it more. But yeah, I mean, you can see that's how you decorate the basis of the journal and then embellish and add your decorations in as you go. Um, I will be posting the finished one up when I'm done. Let's go ahead and decorate the, uh, the cover in a minute. I did do um, a Hortensia, I think that's what they, they pronounce the name, um, one of these, and I gave it to one of my friends, Amanda. She's at, um, Sim I think it's Simply Stampin' Up, Stamp Stampin' Up, I'll put a link in the um, comments and that so you can go and view it on her channel. Um, I gave her it as a, a birthday gift and she put it up on her YouTube. And that one I enjoyed. I spent a long time doing that one. Um, and I'll spend a long time doing this one, but you know, decorating and that. But for now, I'm just rushing and just trying to show you how to do it quick as I can. Um, and I think I'll use the glue. Now you will get a fold in this, that's why um, I've left it decorating to last, I, mean, I would normally do the whole album, I'm just doing it to show you. wrap the flowers you can put wrap tags around here um, I'll probably wrap a few tags around here in a bit and then you can get some lace Like that. 
So, I hope you've learned how to kind of do something basic with paper brown bags. Um, I buy mine at Asda. Um, I'm in UK, so um, there wasn't a period of time where I could get them or buy them. I think lots of people had the same idea as me at the time for arts and crafts. Um, but yeah, I mean, that's what I was doing with the shaker tutorial. So you can use these on, on covers, on cards, inside your journals. Um, I did do a tutorial on how to do a slider for album pages for closing. Um, you can always put the same same idea on the back of these, so then they become um, slider ones. So I think I've done a few journals with them in. But yep, um, should have got my punch out and decorated them. But I'll do that. And you've still got the use of the paper bag to put little gifts in as well. So. Um, thank you for watching. Have a good night or a good day. Take care. Bye.